Hello, this is a program to input and print the elements of an array using point is. This is an array a of 10 and the point is p which is used to point to the array. So I am inputting 5 elements to the array and if these are the elements the first element is a of 0, second element is a of 1, third element a of 2, fourth element of a of 3 and fifth element a of 4. So to point to the first element of the array we can write p is equal to ampersand a of 0 or simply we can write p is equal to a as the as the array name points to the first element of the array and to access the second element I can use p plus 1 because p plus 1 will point to the second element if I increment the pointer value uh, after I after putting uh, p is equal to a uh, the, uh, the the pointer will actually point to the second element of the array if it is p plus 2 it will point to the third element p plus 3 the fourth element and p plus 4 the fifth element of the array so by using these pointer names we can access the different elements so while scanning the elements of the array we are using ampersand a of 0 ampersand a of 1 ampersand a of 2 and ampersand a of 3 ampersand a of 4 within the scanner function so instead of writing these things we can have p p plus 1 p plus 2 p plus 3 and p plus 4 to scan the five elements so that is done here reading the elements so here p is incremented in each step as post increment operation is done in the while executing p plus plus its value will not be reflected here actually p itself will be printed the not the incremented value so while scanning p plus plus means it is actually first scanning p but incrementing the value of p to p plus 1 so in the second iteration it will scan p plus 1 in the third iteration p plus 2 fourth iteration p plus 3 and fifth iteration p plus 4 so after executing uh, after scanning the fifth item it is actually incremented to p plus 5 so to print these elements we have to first reset the pointer to point to the first element of the array that's why p is equal to a is written so while printing we are actually we are actually printing a of 0 a of 1 a of 2 a of 3 and a of 4 so a of 0 that is a of 0 is 2 so a of 0 can be accessed using pointer by using the star operator that is star p is same as 2 star p is same as a of 0 and star p plus 1 is same as the second element a of 1 in this way so by using a star star along with the pointer we can print all these elements so star p will refer to the first element of the array star p plus 1 refer to second element star p plus 2 the third element etc thank you